Hi, I'd like to um, share a, a tip with you I learned from a professional, a professional videographer, a friend of mine, um, who does, uh, amongst other things, a lot of uh, wedding shoots, and it's um, what's really a mini crane shot. It's a lovely sequence shot which makes a, a fantastic effect. Uh, I'm going to use it here uh, on some objects on this uh, table. I've set up a table here with a few objects, and um, I'll show you now how you, how you actually set the shot up. So first of all, um, um, you're going to need it on the tripod, and I'm going to use the tripod as this mini crane. Um, and what you're going to do is just raise the third leg at the back here, like this. And if you can, it doesn't matter if you can't actually, you can raise the leg here at the back. On these photos you can actually, so it's a bit easier to hold the back leg. But if you can't, don't worry about it. Um, so once you've got your tri uh, tripod set up, you're going to use the two front legs here as kind of the pivot of the crane. So um, I'm just going to move them around. So I've set my uh, subject up here in the, uh, on the table here, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, move my camera over it. Now I've got on a 50mm, Canon 50mm 1.8 lens, that's that uh, great value uh, nifty 50 lens, which um, is great for these type of shots because it gives a, it's a wide aperture and gives a very narrow field of focus. You can do the same shot using the kit lens, the 1855. It's just you lose a lot of the out of focus effect, which is nice in this type of shot. But you can still do a crane shot with it and you can practice with it. It still looks acceptable just using this out of focus um, uh, effect using this uh, 50 millimeter, I think looks a bit nicer. So what you're going to do, the first thing you're going to do is having set your tripod up is to get the end point you want to reach on the uh, subject you're filming and focus on that. So you're going to, here I'm going to, on this picture here, for example, Got my focus and I've got the composition I want at the end. And what I'm going to do is just bring the camera back to a beginning where I want to start the shot from. And I'm going to then start recording. And then I'm going to bring the camera up slowly on the legs using it as a kind of a crane, as you can see there, and making sure I end the shot pretty well on the end point that I set there at the beginning. And that's Pretty well, you'll see the effect is, I think, very, very nice, and um, it's very, very professional looking. And add some music to it, and it just looks a, a lovely uh, sequence there. So that's a very quick tip, but I think a fantastic one that will add value to your um, video and make them look much more professional. Um, thanks very much for watching.